Hey, what's up everybody? It's Sage. What is up? How you guys doing? Today I'm going to be doing a different type of video. I'm going to be doing a taste test and review of this hot sauce, Mad 357. Mad Dog 357, that's what it's called. Okay, so this hot sauce is one of the hot sauces that they feature on this show that I watch called uh, Hot Ones, which is a YouTube show. It's very good. I, I recommend watching it. It's very funny. And the premise of the show basically is that this guy is interviewing celebrities and they're eating this this these hot wings with a bunch of hot sauce on it. But the hot sauce is not like your regular like hot sauce. It's the novelty hot sauce. You know, the stuff you see at the craft stores or the specialty shops or, you know, the ones you see like in the uh, souvenir shops. You know, that stuff is just a novelty type of hot sauce that's made for pure pain, not to really eat, you know. But anyway, they doss these hot, hot wings with that stuff. And then he interviews these celebrities and then you watch them in pain as they try to answer the question. So check it out. Well, when you're watching that show, you want to try those hot sauces. So I went and ordered uh, a bunch of them. Today, we're going to start off with Mad Dog 357. And I'll have a couple other videos where I talk about some of the other hot sauces from that show. So anyway, I'm going to put down my cigar. I'm going to open this thing up. I'm going to get this thing over with. All right. So I'm not uh, really good with pain or with hot sauces. I'm okay with it. It's not my thing. But, uh, you know, I'm a man. You know, I can take a little bit of hot hot sauce without a... Uh, I'm getting nervous. I'm just rambling. Let me get this over with. Let me shake this up first. And all I'm going to do... It's just put some on here, eat it, and I'm going to tell you exactly what's going on with this thing, all right? If it's hot or not, if it's just all hype, let me see what it smells like. I don't know. It smells like hot sauce. Let's put some on here. I'm not going to go crazy because I don't know what's going on with this thing. Okay, that's a pretty big dab. Look at that. That's a lot. So let's try this, okay? Here we go. First reaction. And I'm gonna be honest, man. I'm not gonna be like going crazy. I'm not I'm not gonna try to suppress what I feel. And I'm also not gonna like be over hyper and over dramatic. I'm just gonna tell you exactly what's going on. Here we go. Tastes like battery acid. Like, when you first tasted it, it tasted almost like a little good. And then, almost immediately, just nasty. Like, I can't even describe It's just a nasty taste. It is hot. It's kind of hard to talk. Let me get a little bit of Coke. All right, it's nasty, and it's really hot. It really is. And would I recommend it? Yes, as an extract. Don't put it directly on your food like I did. The pain don't go away. It stays. But you want to spice it up your, you know, spicy up your chili or, uh, Put a little bit of extra stuff in your hot sauce or, you know, whatever type of sauce you have. You want to just make it a little bit hot. Just put a little dab in it in a whole pot and it should work. Don't put it directly on your food. It's not necessary. Um, yeah, I wouldn't put this on like my taco or my burrito. It's too hot. I would just cook with it. My nose is actually starting to run. But yeah, that's this is an honest reaction. I'm not over exaggerating. There's some hot stuff, man. Mad Dog 357 is still hot. Just kind of waiting for it to go down. All right. I'm not gonna say anymore. What what else was I gonna say about it? It's still hot. I'm still reeling from it. So 
My nose is running, but you know, whatever. It ta the taste is awful, but it's not that bad. All right. So we'll be back with some more. This is my first time ever doing this type of review. And wow. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.